Hey everyone, welcome back to New Suicide Science, where we discuss comics, movies, games, and more. And we are now doing another Marvel Spider-Man 2 photo mode submission. This one's going to be pretty fun. I actually managed to take a quick sneak peek before I started this one, and I saw some really nice standouts that I really want to look at even more in depth. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. But before I do that, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the bell notification so you all don't miss anything. I post Marvel Spider-Man 2 photo mode submissions every Fridays at some time in the afternoon or sometimes in the evening, depending on the day and depending on how I feel. Um, but definitely you don't want to miss it because every single Fridays, I'd like to review your best Spidey submissions and show it out to the world. And of course you do get credit. So I do have a mix of like, you know, showing the photos, you know, sometimes I go to Twitter and sometimes I even go to uh, discord. So for this example, I have, um, most of the photos here on discord. That's where I get most of the Spidey photos. So if you're interested in submitting your own photos and definitely be sure to click on the invitation link in the description box down below and then invite yourself into the server, join the many Spidey and Marvel fans there on the server. It's a great community and post your best photos in the Spider-Man photo mode submission channel. So anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the Spidey photos that we have here. So now we're gonna go ahead and start with Mikey6198, which I already gave a little flame. Basically submitted two versions of the black suited, the classic black suited costume. Um, having the spider sense, but if I had to pick my favorite one from Mikey 6198, it'll be this one. So I'm zooming it in here. You should be able to see it. So what I like about this is that everything has like everything in this photo, Spider-Man and including a spider sense has a little theme here. Um, I love the blue and purple hues that's used in this photo, including the black costume and even the white parts of the costume, the white spider logo. Where the suit shines is like it has like the purple hues and lighting and blue you know hues as well even the spider sense has like been captured in the light which is awesome this makes a great piece of artwork and a great um, actual like tablet picture or even a phone wallpaper so i want to say phenomenal job there mikey 6198 really love this one so let's go ahead and move into the next one let's see let's see which one which one really sticks out here um really good ones there mikey i really like it now this one's interesting. This one is by, well, don't know the full name, but it just says P. This one's cool. I think this is of Miles Morales in his uh, symbiote suit and he's getting ready to use his blue electricity. And I think it's like the white variation of his costume. And it looks interesting because I love how like in the foreground here, as you can see, his hand and wrist is completely blurred out. And he's right here. You can see the shine and the sleekness of his costume just shining in the lighting appropriately. And also the blue electricity is going is is like engul is engulfing him. And he looks awesome. He looks stunning. It's like mid attack right there. So I really love the shot. Good job, Pete. All right, let's go to the next one. Hello. We got some foam wallpaper here uh, material, which I really like as well. I'm going to give a flame to that one. This one looks really, really cool. It looks like he's getting ready to shoot out his lightning. I think that's when you press um, L2 and square uh, when you do this attack or L2 in the left pad or something. But this one looks really cool. He's, he's right there mid firing his like his blue electricity and the sparks are engulfing him. He's wearing the regular costume, but it looks really, really good. So this one makes a great foam wallpaper if anybody's interested as well. And that's the video about this Discord server. If you're interested in actually downloading some of your friends, um, you know, Spider-Man photo mode submissions, you can. You can definitely do that. I'm pretty sure they'll give you permission to do so. And it'll be quite flattering, you know, if you did that for them. So that's really cool, right? So anyway, great shot there, Solich. Now let's go to the next one. There's some good ones here from A Brothers Animation, who's also a mod on the account. Definitely a new name there. Um, <laughs> I forget who that is. Uh, you guys got to let me know when you change your names or whatever, because <laughs> I'm kind of losing track here. Um, but some really good shots here. This is, of course, of him using the Insomniac Games' version of the black suit fighting the lizard. Let's see if I can find one that really pops out. You know what? Actually, the one that really does stick out, believe it or not, is the simplest one. I actually like this one. Something about Spider-Man walking around the house and walking down the stairs in a alien black suit. I don't know. It's just so casually kind of like speaks volumes for some reason. It just looks right. It looks really, really good. I just can't get over the how, like, I can't get over Insomniac's interpretation of the black suit. It just looks really good. It's still, like, 
uh, is still honoring the classic look, but yet it looks different because of the detail of the muscle and the padding here and the way the costume is laid out and in some parts of the body, you know, of the costume looks alive, like it's moving. It's a very creative choice from Insomniac Games' part, honestly. But I like this one a lot. Great job, Brothers Animation. All right, let's go to another one. Um, there's Craven holding Scorpion by the neck. Getting ready to kill him. <clears throat> let's see here. Um, this one looks really good. No, I'm not going to pick that one. Um, you know what? Magnetic Pool, uh, I'll give you this one. Only re the only reason why I picked this is because I like the hazy effect while he's wearing what Insomniac Games calls it, the symbiote suit. So when you ever, whenever you go into surge rage mode, uh, your costume becomes the symbiote suit, where it's actually alive. It's like another part of you who's kind of like trying to take you, take over you, and it's alive. And this is really cool. I like this one. Great job, Magnipool. Thanks for submitting that shot. What other shots do we have here? Let's see here. Nope. Ah, I saw this one earlier today. I gave it like a little flame, I think. Yeah. So I saw this one earlier today. I have yet to find out how you guys do it. Are you using Photoshop? Because... I don't know how to do this in photo mode because if, if this was the case, then I'd be submitting these types of photos all day on my Instagram, which you should also follow, by the way, because I have an Instagram as well. I have two of them. I have a personal and I have a regular, you know, I have a business one for New Suicide Astonish. I have yet to get an answer for this. Uh, maybe Jawa, if you can tell me, this is who submitted the shot, by the way. It's of Spider-Man in his class, in his like normal advanced 2.0 suit, but in the reflection of the window pane there on the building, that ray tracing is so good, like so cool and it's amazing. In the reflection there, it's of him wearing the Insomnia Games' black suit, which is awesome. I love that. And it makes, it really makes a great album cover if you think about it. It's also, it looks like a really cool comic cover too. So great job, Jawa. I'm really impressed with that one. I mean, the same thing goes for this one. Like maybe it's a two for two. Oh, I remember the flame. Two for two right here. I love the little detail how like when you're using the arms, like the mechanical arms for an attack, the mechanical arms adjusts like its color and design depending on what suit you're wearing. So for this case, in, in this case, for the classic comic book Iron Spider suit, um, the arms look like the arms from the comics and and the, col the coloring changes, you know, so it looks really good. I really love this one. Great job, man. Great job, Jawa. That's a two for two right there. What is it, like six photos already that I that I uh, got to like look at right now? Let's see what we have here. Uh, HS Edit for Fun. That's an interesting name. Okay, so he submitted quite a few photos here, um, but only one can really stick out more than others. And let me see which one I'm going to pick. You know what? Because the subject is also all in black, and it like there's like a, like a bleachy like bleak theme going around uh, around the subject surroundings. I'm gonna go with this one out of the bunch that he submitted. This one was submitted by HS Edit for fun. So this one looks the best. I love how like everything around here is not entirely blurred out, but the objects in the center, like the tendrils that are going across the sky there, are slightly blurred out with a good use of minimum aperture, but the subject is still in focus. And the web line that's being fired by Spider-Man is blurred out in the foreground and it's actually clearer here where it's coming from his wrist this looks amazing i love it great job edit for hs edit for fun amazing shot i see we got another one from g here which also looks really cool this is like like the seventh or eighth photo right here um i like this one it kind of reminds me of a classic black suited like typical comic book cover of spider-man uh he's sitting on like the tendrils that's running across new york and he's just like there with his hands like hanging out looks really chill and relaxed i like this one he's got the angry eyes on and so this one's a good job uh, shot right there great job g i would like this one a lot i always appreciate a good venom shot um this one was also submitted by i guess it would seem g oops let me give you that fire again and what i like about this game is that in some of the games, when it comes to like the design of Venom, I think they did him justice. He's got that gnarly, nasty, teethy, like saliva, gunky look to him. Like he looks monstrous and disgusting. And I love how grotesque he looks. Like even this scene right here where he's grabbing Spider-Man with one hand, because it goes to show how monstrous and ferocious he is. Um, just getting ready to slam him like he's slamming a basketball. It's actually not too far off from like that one meme that I found online of like, then I'm getting ready to slam ball, like I do a slam dunk with a basketball. Um, it looks really cool. 
I really like it a lot. And I love the effect that the anti-venom has on Venom, where like every time he like he hits him, it's like he's burning, which looks really cool. I hate that costume from Miles. Let's see. But if I had to pick my favorite shot, I'd say this one. Because it's just really gnarly. I really love this one a lot. It kind of reminds me of those classic 90s comic books where Venom's like tongue is like contorted in a very awkward way. And like he's got like that gnarly teeth everywhere and all that saliva and like Peter Parker, Spider-Man or whatever. He's trying to like keep away from him and everything. Like he's trying to keep his face away from his mouth. It's just so, ugh, it's disgusting that I love it. Great job, man. That's a two for two right there for you. I don't know what was going on here, Solich. Maybe you were like up to like something here. Maybe you like you thought this was like a kink opportunity or something, but it's kind of weird, honestly. Like, see what else that we have here. This looks really cool to repost, but I think I've seen that before already. So yeah, it's a repost. And that's pretty much it. Um, let's look at, look at some of the regular shots here. I like this one a lot. Um, it's of Peter and the gang. You know, there's MJ. There's Harry. Wearing the cowboy hat and glasses. <laughs> this is funny. I'm not gonna like, you know, I'm not gonna say, oh, it looks cool and the lighting and everything's so, good. Good job with the aperture and everything, but I like the focus on the three main subjects here. Um, this is actually pretty funny. I like it. It doesn't always have to be all about Spider-Man, but I like that shot, and that's a that's a good one as well. Let's see if we can find a bonus one. One one for more, one more just to end this uh, Marvel Spider-Man 2 photo mode submission. I know I saw one earlier today that I really liked and i wanted to like acknowledge it a little bit Ooh, this is from a screen this is from like a scene if i'm not mistaken you know another question real quick a little uh why isn't like the mark for me like metal suit from like the first game not in this one i really love that costume they should bring it back i hope they bring it back in like either dlc or they add it later like post launch or whatever or something like that um i think i know what exactly you were going for here radiation gum this is like you're trying to match the ending of No Way Home, like the final swing. I get what you're going for. It looks good nonetheless, by the way, but I think your first two shots that you submitted over here look even better, especially like the black suit in this end because it just glows in the right ways and it looks really good. I just wish that Insomniac Games did a better job of like accurately capturing the, the costume, like the black suit. It looks close to the film, but it just, it's not perfect. But if I had to pick, this is my favorite one. A torn up, you know, spider advanced suit 2.0 Spider-Man suit with like black goo in the background looks really cool. I like this one a lot. This definitely makes for a great cover and a great comic book cover. So Radiation Gum, thank you so much for submitting your shot. I love it. I had a great time with these photos, guys. You guys are amazing for submitting the like these amazing Spidey shots. Um, thank you all so much for submitting your shots. I look forward to more next week. So you have a whole week to submit as many as you can. And for those of you who are new, please be sure to subscribe. Um, I've been losing uh, and gaining subscribers. It's been really weird for the past two months now. Ever since the launch of Marvel Spider-Man 2, my YouTube channel is kind of like taking a hard hit, especially with the algorithm and YouTube's not really pushing out my channels anymore. And also YouTube is removing inactive subscribers or what seems to be bots. They're removing them away from my account. And it's making it seem like I'm like stagnant and I'm just not growing. I'm doing the best I can by uploading my videos on a daily. I know I say that, but it like lately I've been trying. So please subscribe. If anybody's interested in Spider-Man or Marvel content in general, then definitely be sure to let them know to subscribe because it would really greatly help me out. And as always, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the notifications so you all don't miss anything. And I'll see you all in the next comic panel.